Typically, your freshman year of college includes a chance to create your own living space for the very first time, but some TSU students were not met with a dorm room, but rather a hotel room off of campus. The university cites record enrollment numbers for this issue. Well, News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs shows us where some of the students are staying and the problems coming with it. That room was horrific. The bathroom appears to have mold. Um, it wasn't clean. Keontae Humes shows us pictures of the room. Hold on one second. Her daughter was assigned this year at Tennessee State University. This is the bathroom. That's the bed. Humes is surprised to learn her child will be spending the semester at the Red Roof Inn. It's a TSU issue because you could have chose a lot of other hotels. Why did you choose this one? TSU officials say it's because of a large incoming freshman class projected at more than 2,500 first year students. And Nashville's increased cost of living is preventing many of its students from living off campus. I'm not bashing Rare Roof because some people are okay with Rare Roof. My issue is TSU and the housing for the babies. Like, our tuition increased this year, and then you take my daughter off campus and put her here. I found out a week before moving in. Even college students are telling us they're disappointed. You can't even focus in here. You, you're constantly looking around to see if something is on the bed, if something is on the wall. This returning student is talking about the bugs she found in her hotel room. And I killed five yesterday. I come into my room and it's five today. In a statement, TSU officials say, quote, we take the concerns of students and their parents seriously. Any concern regarding the condition of a room is addressed immediately, whether on campus or at an off-campus housing facility. Hotel management is expected to resolve all issues right away upon notification at our off-campus sites, end quote. These rooms are not suitable for college students trying to learn. However, it's not the college experience many have hoped for. Because they keep admitting people with nowhere to put them. And it's like, soon as you are a sophomore, they don't care about you anymore. This student says she won't be back next semester. They deserve something better. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5. Meantime, TSU President Dr. Glenda Glover says she wouldn't put students in a place she wasn't willing to stay in herself. So she spent the night at the Best Western, one of the university's off-campus housing options. She says she wishes her stay could have been longer, but they needed the room for a student. TSU tells us that students uh, can attend online for free. That's if they paid a deposit or live in off campus housing. They also say they're working closely with the state to add more residence halls on campus.